is July 4th. We got all these fireworks. It has been raining like 30 feet of rain. I know. What man. are we gonna do? I are don't you, know, man. Are you disappointed? I, I'm disappointed. You know, I used to have a chemistry set. I, I still got it. You do? We could. We, we could we make, could we yeah. could fix something up that the yeah. rain won't impact, yeah. and we'll still have fireworks. All right. Hey, I found the chemistry set. If you remember, I blew up the box that originally came in, but we got the stuff. Okay, now we already took care of the gunpowder, the gold sash. So listen, I'm going to take the ferric oxide All right. mixed with magnesium okay. sulfate uh -huh. and hydrochloric something or, or whatever. It sounded dangerous, but oh, it yeah. shouldn't be. <laughs> so it's, we'll mix it in it's here. Fine. Oh, we'll pour it into mind. this because oh. it's a cone, oh. and that way we'll know for sure when the fire goes up, it'll it'll go at, at this angle. Well, maybe it's this angle. One of these angles it's going to go up at. Okay. But okay. we'll let it sit for a few minutes. All right. And then we'll light it. Okay. When I light this thing, run like your life depends on it. I hear you, man. Here we go. explosion right now. We know not very much about what has happened. We just know that this event occurred yesterday evening and that it pretty much took away the entire house that was standing on this location. If you can see behind me, right there is the only remaining piece of the house and that is the wood that was in the fireplace. Um, we will get back to you when we have more developments. Thank you. Thank you, Mike. In other news, there is a women's retreat at Frankfurt First Assembly of God on July 11th through the 13th. Also on July 13th through 19th, LWU team will be ministering in Jackson, Kentucky. Pray for those who are going. I think we have more developments from the Thursday morning men's prayer group. To you, Dad. Bill, what do you think happened? What do you think the cause of What was the source? What are your thoughts on this incredible matter? I'm thinking, I'm thinking it's false flag. What country are we getting ready to go into next? Where's the Arab Spring going to strike next? I'm thinking this was a tactical nuke. They're going to use this. They're going to blame it on somebody else. We're going to go into their country, make another mess. We're going to have martial law. I'm just, uh, I don't know. I'm just, i got no place to put this. It just goes on and on and on and on. Johnny, what do you think about the explosion? I think it's caused by the implants. The implants? The implants in who or the implants in what? The government put them here. The Illuminati's. Illuminati government implants. You got it right from John. So you, what do you think happened? What do you think caused the explosion? What's the truth behind this whole mess? I think it's just a bunch of malarkey. And the fact is, oh, really? it's just, it's just nature. I mean, we've got all them cars lined up there. That light sitting there broke, and and all that sulfuric acid coming up out of them catalytic converters and coming up out of the batteries and the cloud cover was low and someone lit a match and yeah. just blew the top yeah. off of the whole town. That's what happened. I can guarantee it. There you have it. Thank you, Dad. There's a business meeting after church today to discuss an amendment to the constitutional bylaws concerning weddings on our property. On July 27th at 10 a.m., there's a women's get-together. Women, please come. And on July 31st at 6 p.m., there's a girls' ministry pizza party. We have more on the explosion right now. Thank you, honey. It seems to have cleared up a bit out here. There's not so much rain, but we have made some interesting discoveries. The neighbors say they saw the explosion happen, and they saw two young men standing outside near the grave over there. and they lit it on fire. We have no idea how the grave survived, but we do believe this is an unfortunate turn of events. The crowds are gathering, the crowds are huge over here. The 
crowds are so huge that they have set up porta parties on the property. So we have made some amazing discoveries today. We appreciate all you viewers. This is WLWM, Micah Coverstone, signing out. Good evening. <laughs>